hello and welcome to another logic tutorial this time talking about random velocity okay so random velocity does exactly that it randomizes the velocity um, of the a midi region so you might want to use that if like i have here created a baseline um, using an upright bass sound and i want it to sound live um, now a real upright bass player wouldn't hit every single note at exactly the same volume like I've got here at the moment. It's just not natural. They would naturally hit the notes at varying velocities. Um, so logic gives us a quick and easy way of doing that. Um, very much like random pitch. So if we select the track you want to deal with, so it's the bass here, load up the event list if it's not already loaded go to edit select all go to functions transform and random velocity and that brings up this page um, it will automatically come up with random here there are some other options in there um, but we're only interested in random for now so keep that there top one is the upper limit of the velocity so I think we'll go for 120 on this one for a wheel thwack. Um, and then the bottom number is the the bottom threshold. So the lowest you want the volume to go to. So I don't want too big a range because if I do that, then when I come to compressing it later on, um, I've got more work to do. Um, so I'm going to put it at about 95. So I've got a range of 25 there. Okay. So once I've done that, I just click operate only. And you can see over here in the event list, that's randomized it. Okay, so I've got some 105, got some 120, and then some down as low as 99 and 98. So if I press play now. Okay, that's probably a bit harsh. I've probably set the upper range a bit too much there. Um, so I just go in and, and I just go to edit, undo transform, and then go through the process again. So I just go into functions, transform, random velocity, um, and maybe bring this down to about 115, and that down to 90, and click operate. Okay. So if you're not happy with the random thing, you can undo it, go back, try it again. And then you may find you want to go in and just tweak certain bits by hand, just by going onto the individual note. If, for example, I think that first note's too hard, I can just go in and bring that down a little bit more like that. And that's random velocity. Okay. 